My name is Rachel Ward-Maxwell and I'm a researcher programmer in astronomy and space sciences at the Ontario Science Centre. I first met Artash and Arushi through the Royal Astronomical Society of Canada and I've always been uh, amazed and inspired by the work that they're doing and I think that every time I cross their path I'm always amazed by their love of science and their creativity and, and uh, all the new projects that they have on the go. Hi, my name's Artash Nath and I'm 12. Hi, my name's Arushi Nath and I'm 9. We're very interested in space robotics, science, making things. A few years ago, I joined the Royal Astronomical Society of Canada. So there, there was telescopes, and every night we used to look, look at planets, galaxies. We're very interested in astronomy because we joined the RASC. So basically, when we have a project, we try to demonstrate it in the most amount of events we can. Recently, we've been making model rockets, and we're adding sensors to them. And we also added a camera so we can take the video of the launch. And we were actually getting live data from the rocket. So it was really cool. So when the rocket launched, we were able to see the acceleration of the rocket while it was going up. TRAPPIST-1 is basically a solar system with seven planets. And they all move in harmonical motion. So we decided to visually show that using LED strips. So we take a big board, put seven LED strips to, re to represent the orbits of the planets, and we put a big globe in the center to rep represent the star. First, we show them like things that they can see and try to make them get interested in it. And then we sh show them how to do it, and then hopefully they'll go home and try to Even if they're not actually interested in the science, technology, engineering, mathematics, they might be interested in something else, arts, sports, etc. But even for these things, they still use science. I think that's what a lot of people don't realize, that they think that if you study science, then you have to be a scientist. And that's not necessarily the case. Science has so much application to every job you can possibly have. Well, I would like to be an astronaut because I'm very interested in space. I would like to visit Mars because there's a chance of life. When I'm older, I'd like to work on something with like rockets and well, maybe I could send my sister to Mars. <laughs> <laughs>